What's up? What's up? What's up? Josh? Are you still there, Josh? 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 <laughs> Good evening. It's a, just a short live stream because, well, it's not scheduled, but there's a reason why I went live tonight. We're celebrating three years of this Lonely World, word, pff, Lonely World series. Yes. Imagine mo three years na kami. I mean, yeah, three years na tong Lonely World series na to. And as promised on sa previous live stream, I'm gonna give you guys a world tour. Tour of the world. World tour of the world. Tour, 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 world tour. I cannot even pronounce it well. World tour. Jesus. Right, let's get into it. And I hope you enjoy. It's a short live stream. Uh, I hate the music. Yeah. Anyway, it's... Uh, I'm gonna give you. I'm gonna show you guys where it all started and where we are right now. Ganunyo, that's the kind of uh, tour that I'm gonna give. I hope you enjoy. Yeah. <laughs> so how did we start? Well, I'm gonna bring you back there, dun sa ground zero, where I spawned. Oy, pinatay ko pala yung vote. So for those just joining, warami salamat. Uh, this is this is just a world tour. I'm not sure if we're gonna build later. I don't think we'll build. We're gonna build tonight because hey, I want to focus on going around. You know, trip to the memory lane. Trip to uh, you know, how it all started three years ago. So okay, let me uh, have uh, let's wait till daytime. Okay, Marami salamat guys. Thanks for very much for those who have uh, been supporting me for the past three years in this series. I know it's not that much, but you know. <laughs> All right, for those who've been been watching my live stream uh, or w following this series, every time I die and I don't have my bed with me, uh, this is where I spawn. Because uh, this is the ground zero. This is it. Dito ako, for the, uh, when I uh, started this world, ito yung ano, spawn area. And then, this was my starter house. It's still here. Hindi ko demolish. I want to preserve it. And then, these roofs uh, came in later. So, yeah, this is where I started three years ago. Mm. Uh, this is where I started three years ago. And this and. When I started it, I remember undamming hills and trees. Basically, it was it was a dark, dark oak forest or nandito. So every everything was covered in um, dark oak and everything. So fa to make long story short, uh, from this starter house, I started working on the you know actual base, and then with that, I. I don't actually remember. I don't remember how it all... <laughs> Yes, trip to the memory lane and I forgot the stories of my builds. But, uh, but I can remember the... You know, this was my starter house. Okay? And then I proceeded to building this... Uh, uh, my permanent base, which is this one. And then I also decided na I'll make a basement... And with all the storage and everything. It did look like this uh, when I first started. Uh, it was very small and I just expanded it big time. And yeah, that's to, that's to make long story short. <laughs> and then when I've established that, the first thing that I wanted to do at that time is, uh, you know, to be self-sustaining with my XP with my fuel stores, so I decided to build the bamboo farm and this uh, cactus farm and the kelp farm. So this one is uh, for the XP. Excuse me. This is the XP farm down here, and then yeah. So basically, that's how it all started. And then this uh, enchanting area came in later. All right. So this is. The reason why I named it uh, the Edge of Glory is because we're literally at the edge of the of the map, as you can see. Yeah, no, <laughs> that's where we are right now, and that's 
this is the world before the 1.19, right? So yeah. So from from the ground zero or edge of glory, depending how you want to call it. From here, I decided to uh, create. Um, where where can we continue from here? Uh, when I start, wala pa tong tower. Okay? It took me like three months before I decided na to build this tower. And it was also around that time when I decided that I have to build uh, villager trading halls. So one of the first uh, villagers that I um, breeded was the librarians. And that's why we have this uh, building right here. This is where I used to keep my... Uh, mga librarians before as you can see they're empty they're not here anymore said so they're on the better place and all that stuff and yeah so i decided to build mga trading halls these trees i mean well trading hall uh, another trading hall right here and there uh i created the farmer Villagers. Oh man, this brings back a lot of memories. This one. <laughs> I, I call this the ugly silo because it looked like a silo before. Uh, before all this um, fancy stuff were built like this one. So this one came in just later this year. And all I had all my villagers inside, ow, inside this building. And... It came to the point na, wait, I need to make my base bigger and my tradings, you know. Because all my projects are getting bigger and I need to parang meet the demands. Anyway, I decided to build this one and wait, this one came first. And then I decided to build a string farm, which is right here. And then after that... What did I do after that? Oh, I also built... So, the in chronological order... Chronological order, I I first built this, uh, this one, this starter house, and then this main base, and then the, ex, the farms, etc. And then I built the villager trading halls, which is that, one, two, and then the, this one. I think I remember this one's the third trading halls that I had and these are the and I forgot I forgot the professions that they're in cartographers <laughs> the reason why I put them here is because the cartographers need to see the world so that was my thought process you see and it's still relevant yeah if I'm gonna make another uh, trading hall uh with cartographer villagers i'm gonna put them somewhere it's gonna floating island this time i don't know anyway so we'll so um what happened after that after building what's over here i decided to uh expand the roads and this was the, this was the time that wala pa ako elytra so i decided to build the first thing i built was the roads that leads that lead me from uh from that base over here i was thinking at that time my thought process was i'm gonna make another base right here another house but you know <laughs> that idea came down very quickly and then i decided that hmm, maybe i need melon and pumpkin farm so to make long story short i built it right i built it right here and it's still functioning despite that i have a new melon and pumpkin farm i'll, I'll show it to you later so yeah, this is the melon, the first melon and pumpkin farm that can be converted into a bone meal farm. It's not as efficient that I, that uh, it's not as efficient as the demand, you know, keeps increasing, but it still works. So I built, I first built this house, and then I built uh, this pumpkin farm. Melon and pumpkin car. Uh, the reason why I built this is because in my mind I needed uh, I needed the AFK area, and as you can see, there are a lot of cats. <laughs> yep. 
I'm a cat person. And then after that, I build the iron farm right here. Um, I need to, yeah, this is, I need to build another iron farm in the future. Sa bagong base. So that's the iron farm and the melon pumpkin farm in the AFK area. Well, there are plenty of AFK areas over here. <laughs> and then as, and this is just an experimental area, this one, the parang industrial site where there used to be a lot of uh, spruce woods over here and then i decided that hmm, for decorative purposes i uh experimented on this i haven't i haven't continued working working around here because i plan to make a custom you know custom uh, landscape right here with incorporating spruce wood and everything but i ran out of uh, spruce wood so i leave that project for for a while <laughs> so yeah and then uh, mga roads and yeah mga the time frame for this was around early 2000 uh, 2021 right and then sometime along that line i started experimenting building this is when uh, 1.16 came out so i experimented with uh mga new materials like blackstone and everything blackstone and mixing it with other building blocks i decided to uh you know just build i call this mga filler builds because it's wala naman plano when i started building this and then i connected this one and uh, this land this land and this was the time na wala pa akong elite run all that until one day someone told me na maybe it's time to go to the end and get whatever end stuff so that's what I did. And then I went to the end and defeated the dragon for the first time. This is the very first dragon head. Right? And there's the egg over there. Um sinadya ko talaga na I mean, I really thought this through na dito ko ilalagay yung egg. So this is like the mausoleum of those fancy stuff like the dragon's egg, the first dragon's breath. Medyo sentimental ako, yun. <laughs> so I, def I decided to build this small plaza or whatnot. Uh, just a reminder na this is what I did for the first time. And this was also around early 2021. Build dito. Yeah. And I decided to build this one as well and all that stuff. Yeah. And then sometime in mid 2021, I decided that hey, since I'm getting I'm gaining a lot of viewers and followers, I dedic I dedicated a compound, which I'll build some houses, in, you know, in dedication for those viewers who supported me. So if you give me real money, <laughs> I'm gonna build the house. So that's what I did and. As you can see, there's may mga, you know, blueprints or red prints in this case, uh, where the future builds will go. So all of these are are named or in honor of, the, of my supporters. So this one, uh, yeah, <laughs> it's named after my viewers, and I have to get. I've, I didn't do my assignment. I, I don't have the list of my viewers for which goes which. Basta ito yon. These are the builds dedicated to my viewers. Right? Uh, Murphy's Greenhouse. All that stuff. Fruitsy Loops. Yeah, I remember those guys. And then Audrey's Garden over here. Yeah. So while we're here, let me just gather some uh, materials, which maybe I left lying around. Ooh. Hmm. I don't think that I would need that. Anyway, so yeah. So this was the compound. Uh, it's called, I named this Mississippi after a uh, unfortunate misspelling of Mississippi. <laughs> so yeah, this, is, this whole compound right here, uh, it's going to grow big once I am able to do so. But all the builds right here are named after my viewers and it's in you know dedication to the viewers who supported me all this all these years 
<laughs> Three years lang eh. All these years na. <laughs> Weird boy. So anyway. Yeah, we will go somewhere. We will... This is not in chronological order. Uh. I'm just showing you all what's been happening so far. And then... Sometime after that... Well, in the middle of that, to be honest, uh, I was also... This is also one of the early farms that I built. The tree farm designed by Il Mango and the nether... Uy! Damn! I disconnected keyboard go. And the tree farm and this nether stuff warps and crimson farm. I think was... I think this too was designed by Il Mango. So I... I, uh, I watched a tutorial and literally... Um, you know, copied. It's not. It's not cheating. It's literally, literally out of from their tutorials. So the tree farm and everything. It's working very efficiently, and yeah, the deck. It's obviously not. Uh, wala pang mga builds dito, kasi you know, I just can't be bothered. I don't want to force myself building stuff, kasi you know, it's just like art. When you force art. When you force fart, it's like, you know, it's very bad. Poop will come out. <laughs> Isipin nyo na lang utot yung, uh, you know, pag pinilit mo yung utot, may lalabas na kasama yun. <laughs> anyway, so this is the sheep farm, the wool farm of all colors. Uh, wala, wala nang mga shears, kaya they have their colors displayed. Yeah. Anyway. So, ang hindi ko napakita dito ay yung cemetery. There's only one casualty so far. And most, uh, it's actually my pet. <laughs> Oink dog. Yeah. There was an unfortunate accident na, na nangyari off camera while building the one of those farms. Nalaglag siya. And then, yeah, this is one of my pets. Early pets. Yeah. Uh, oh, ito pala yung... Uh, ang tawag dito? Whatchamacallit? The slime farm, which I haven't visited for a long time. Yeah, the slime farm. We're not gonna go there because uh, it's tedious to go down there. Natur ko na ba lahat? Oh, the Picasso the only modern building na nagawa ko is this. I call it Picasso. <laughs> and then, the creeper farm, yeah. Um, I originally had a creeper farm right beside the iron farm. But uh, I realized na once I had Elytra and I have to make lots of uh, rockets, it turned out that it's not as efficient. So I have to uh, build another creeper farm. So... Yeah, this is a, this is the only creeper farm that I have, and all that stuff. I'm touring the world in non chronological order, uh, cause I just can't be bothered by doing so. Yeah. Anyway, uh, yeah, my gunpowder, very efficient gunpowder farm. Uh huh. So saan na tayo? So na tour na natin yung edge of glory. I call it the edge of glory because we're literally on the edge. And these are thousands, tens, thousands of blocks of ocean. I, I even, you know, got to the point na I have to, parang, I was considering na restart the world kasi ang pangit talaga ng world generation to at that time. So, but anyway, things are bad. I found a way around it. Oh, sakit sa mata. And... We continued despite the sobrang pangit ng world generation. Okay, so we will leave the... Ay, ito pala, hindi ko pa napakita. The cobblestone farm, the updated one. The 2022 version. The very, very efficient. Like, big time. Wala pang 10 minutes, mapupuno na, na tong, uh, uh chest full of cobblestones. Do you want me to demonstrate it? But before we demonstrate... I'll do some admin works. Marami, sal Marami salamat, guys. 
E, what's this? This is cringe. <laughs> Nagulalo ko ba yung, ano, yung, yung connection na yun? Ang grainy ng, ang grainy ng aking live stream, ha? Let me know, ha, what you think. Alright? I don't want to alienate mga viewers. Uh, refresh, 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 refresh. And everything. Yun. Anyway, let's continue. So this was this is the cobblestone farm, uh, and then right beside it, this is like two farms in one, eh? in one compound, one building. Um, so cobblestone farm above, and this is the cooking facility for my uh, smooth stone. Wait, kailang ko pala to, no? <laughs> Yeah, let me get some of this while we're here. I think this. Oh. Redstone uh, shulker box. Uh, I think this is one of the most, aside from the tree farm, uh, one of the hassle things to build. Because, well, why do I need this lo lots of uh, cobblestone? Well, because I use them for uh, temporary blocks, among a builds, among a big builds, which I'll show you later. All right? Ayun. So, cobblestone farm. And then sometime late, uh, early this year, I decided na to update itong uh, farmer's compound. This, this, this was the time that I was moving out mga villagers from this area. Because I decided that maybe they need a specific area for all the trades. You know, the only villagers that I have right here is the cartographers, uh, the farmers. I think that's... That's it. And the fishermen's. Well, hindi ko lang, wala namang masyadong investments sa uh, fishermen's. But, this is my source of income, guys. Itong mga to. Uh, pumpkin and melons. <laughs> when I say income, mga, mga emeralds and all that, I do a lot of trades here and all that. And that's how I get rich. That's why I have lots of emeralds. Now, before we move out, papakita ko lang sa inyo yung bank that I made. Uh, nandun yung mga rich teas ko. Eh. Nandun yung mga emeralds. Nandun yung diamonds. Na napakadami. Well, napakadaming emeralds. Yeah, I decided yung mga valuables to be stored here. Wala, man, wala naman magdanakaw dito kasi... Uh, well, first of all, ako lang kasi yung tao dito sa world na to. So, this is where I store them, mga emeralds. And the diamonds on the other side. I haven't... Yeah, ito lang diamonds ko. <laughs> yeah. Four stacks, five stacks of uh, diamond blocks. Alright, so we'll move out from this wor uh, this part of the base. Uh, it's, it sucks na it's raining, no? Ay nako. Right. Now we will I've done this uh parang atag dito. Early this year. As you can see may mga temporary blocks dito mga cobblestone. These are the cobblestone. This would um I know I know na I may elytra na ako and all that. But I decided that you know you need the proper road in a way. So I decided na to carve out or pave the way rather ayan ito yung mga ito yung mga sinasabi kong temporary temporary blocks just to lay out yung ways is that a pun? no it's not so ayun uh, ayaw magload yung world so ito yung temporary blocks that would lead us to the villager trading halls right um, the reason why nandito yung itong mga temporary blocks is because that's how I want the road to be. I mean, antag dito. You know, in the future, once I have, once I'm capable of, I'm gonna, I'm gonna replace this cobblestone with the actual blocks that I'll be using for the road. And here we are. Bagal magload every time I go here. Etong world na to, no? So yeah, eto yung andito yung mga trading, trade, villager tradings. Na inalis ko from my base. The librarians are here. Well, more librarians. Ayan, that's a lot of them. And then, ito storage for the papers and all that stuff. 
Hello, hello, Kai. Why, why are you calling me Asian old man? Am I that old? Am I that? Mukha na ba? Mukha na ba bangkay? <laughs> Mukha na ba bangkay? How dare you? Hehe. <laughs> well, friends, well, friends. Let me know what you think. Uh, I'm just giving the world for those who just joined in. I'm giving the world tour of my world that I've been living, flying, surviving for the past three years. So let me know what you think. All right, and uh, support. Thanks for the support for the past three years. Hello, James, Jamis. Oh my gosh, my real life friends are here. Oh, I'm so shy. Please don't tell anyone how I live. <laughs> for those who just joined in, I'm giving the world tour of my world, my happy place. Minecraft happy place. Your Minecraft world is happy place. <laughs> anyway, this one. Um, all right, this one is something very special. I don't build na to, uh, Before this, this, and this builds uh, were built, for the lack of better words. Um, I started this compound, itong project na to, back in January this year. Okay, January this year, I got COVID and I was just starting to work on this new trading hall. Ito. So I, the whole time, the whole isolation pre period, I was working on this and I was isolated for three weeks because it was really that bad. So I just uh, worked on this. This is my, uh, well, right at that time, this was my biggest build. All right, with all that stuff, and dilalangaw na naman aking live stream, dilalangaw na naman. Ako. Anyway, so yeah, at that time, this was my biggest build na nagawa ko. Wow, ang laki ng lamok. Akala ko langaw. Excuse me, I'm celebrating the three years of my Minecraft series, and you come along. Wait lang. I'm gonna target this, and I'll let you know kung nahuli ko tong lamok na to. Where are you? I'm like a cat. I'm waiting for the mosquito. I'm I locked target locked and I hope I get to catch this mosquito. Tas ipapakita sa live stream no. <laughs> I cannot help it. It's really annoying. I hope you burn on the light. I missed it. <laughs> anyway, let's continue the world tour. Let's continue the world tour. So yeah, as I was saying, ito yung biggest build got that time ng January. And then, once uh, once I built this, I decided to build another trading hall, which is this one. Wala pa akong pangalan nito, but my, I think some of my loyal viewers would remember the inside joke that they made to name this itong specific build na to. I don't want to repeat it. I want my viewers to say it. <laughs> Pag nakita nila to, bala sila. Oh, say the, say the name. Say the name. Oh, shucks. Nahuli ko yung lamok. <laughs> yeah. Nahu nahuli ko yung lamok. Don't worry. My hands are clean. <laughs> anyway, so I built this. Ay. And then... After that, I built additional builds, parang filler builds, uh, just to, you know, add vibe. As you can see, it's empty. And then I decided, hmm, let's put all the villagers that I can put. Uh, let's put all the possible villagers and the professions in one compound. So there are like one, two, three, four, five, uh, six uh, professions right here. Uh, ito yung weaponsmith, toolsmith, and ano yung sa? shepherd. Nandito sila. So this is three layers of uh, uh, shopping mall, as you can say. And right now, this is the third biggest build na nagawa ko. Wait a minute. Oh, I totally forgot about this. <laughs> Etong floor na to. Um, yeah. This is my third biggest build in this world. Etong, etong, where we are right now. 
I yeah I don't I don't miss the process of uh, no, moving the villagers and all that stuff. Yeah, it was a hassle, but it was fun for the viewers. <laughs> so yeah, I think mga villagers and all that. And there's Iron Golem. Hello. Is it too dark in here? So, so after I built after I built this one, this was around mga June, I think, if I can remember. Ah, I don't remember. Kela ba lumba sa 1.19? Yeah, mga June, May, June. I decided na I'll do some landscaping, like the basic one. So I decided to build some experimental tree. Uh, candles and everything so I built that here and there it's not yet finished obviously but I ran out of ideas by this point so I need one gonna and then I decided that hmm, maybe I should wall the I should put wall in this compound and as you can see it's not yet finished yeah I, I built this two weird very expensive entrance to the, what's supposed to be the entrance of the of the this villager trading compound I kind of regret using quartz here I, I could have used sandstone but here we are <laughs> alright before we continue ooh, I think I would need this one but nah not now anyway uh, so yeah before we leave this area uh, the last thing that I built in this uh, this area is the mud farm the most hassle farm next to the tree farm. So yeah, this is the storage. And this is the mud farm. <laughs> and this was around June. I decided uh you know, I need a farm for the 1.19 stuff and the mud. I really like this block actually. So for it for this one to work, um uh, I turn this on. No, wait. How do I do this again? <laughs> so yeah, I turn this on. Okay. And then you just have to place this. And yeah, there you have it. And that there's a TNT uh, duplicator over there. That would farm all the mud blocks. Woo. And there you go. Hmm. <laughs> So yeah, that's the mud farm and the storage of everything that's farmed will go here. I think I have I have overdone it by this one, by this point. Yeah. So the mud farm. Oh my God! Nakalimuta ko pala to. <laughs> Nakalimuta ko pala to. The 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 temporary storage. <laughs> yeah. Ang dami na pala natin mud blocks. We can actually build a floating far floating island already. <laughs> All right, so we will leave this area and then we will we're slowly coming, you know, we're slowly you know fast forwarding. I, whatever. I forgot, I ran out of words to say. <laughs> James, are you still watching? Don't tell anyone how I live. <laughs> Um, so let's fast forward to mga July, August. This was the time na parang naglalay down na ako eh. So I was thinking, what else can I do? What else can I build? Uh, so I decided to build etong pathways that will lead me back to the base. Right? Uh, I'm not, hindi, hindi ako nakukwento in chronological order. Ah. So... Pasensya ka nung medyo nakakalito. So, have we, ano, have we, may na-miss out ba ako? Anyway, before we go to where we are right now, may, uh, papakita ko sana yung map room, which I need to transfer this soon, whenever it gets big. Uh, yeah, the map room. So, that's where we are. Hindi natin pumunta na to lahat, obviously. <laughs> Kasi ang layo and all that. So, nandun tayo, nandun tayo right now. Uh, there. Doon sa green na yon Wala akong Optifine. Hindi ko mapakita. Um, sa Nether. Right? 
I create another link that would lead us to this woodland. Ayun. As you can see, sobrang layo. <laughs> it will take forever for us to get here. But that's not all. <laughs> I'll show it to you. Okay, so we will go to the nether and I'll give you guys a tour of the nether. This time. Remind me not to use the bed down there. <laughs> yeah. So we are fast forwarding the ano, yung timeline here. So as you can see, nat nasabi ko na yan, the kelp farm, etc. So ito yung nether portal. I've overdone this to be honest. Medyo na overdo ko to. So we go na we'll now go to the nether and I'll show you around and now hopefully we will not burn up. <laughs> or we not get squished. Right. So this is the uh this is the nether antag dito. Yung nether safe house. I call it safe house kasi it we're safe in theory. And then, wala mga skeleton, skeletons, skeletons and all that. And I've decided this parang office uh, warehouse or whatever. I was, I had this idea of building a parang build right here and obviously it didn't work. Uh, but it's still functional and everything. It's still functional. Uh, nandito yung mga, well, small storage of some sorts. Uy, kailangan ko to. Kailangan ko din to. Kailangan ko dito. Okay. I'll explain why I need those uh, later. Okay. Anyway. So yeah, the small cooking area and everything. And... Yeah. I'm, so, one of the biggest thing that I did over here was to build a gold farm. Sa nether. So, ito yung nether safe house natin. One of the things that I built around here is the gold farm, as you can see. Right? Uh, the gold farm. Tada, as you can see, may mga piglins na na hulog and all that. Alright, you may be asking, Richard, but hindi mo to ginawa above the nether roof, you know, above the bedrock. The thing is, I'll be, I'll be playing around with the bugs, I mean, the glitches in Minecraft, and I don't want that. Um... You know, it's kind of too risky in a way. That was my thought process at that time. So as a consequence, I built I built the platform here and then I spawn proof at least 500 or 200 blocks away from, you know, I spawn proof everything by placing buttons and all that. Buttons here, buttons there. My gosh, this was around April or April of 2020. Ayan, we must buttons everywhere and all that stuff. Ayan, your gold farm, etc. And as you can see, ito yung automated sorting system ang ingay. Lots of gold. Ay, kinawa ko na pala yung gold, but you know, you get the idea. Ooh, very noisy. Yeah, it's very efficient. Uh,. Do you want to build it? Do I want to build this again? Something like this in the future? Uh, if I if I have to, then I will. But it was really a hassle, especially to get those, you know, get this one working. Because I had trouble, eh? Because nakatawid yung mga piglins to to destroy yung uh, turtle eggs. So. <laughs> I had to fig it, it took me a while before me to figure out what to do here. So yeah, I do gold farm. I I have to spawn proof everything. And so after building this, I decided na since I'm collecting gold, I need it for my piglin trading hall, which is right here. Uh we thought right now we have like four, five, six, seven, eight. 9, 10, 11 piglins and I plan to add I plan to add you know 8, 9 more piglins right here and how this work is I just simply turn this gold dropper on 
and then yung mga items na they will be trading will fall off down here. Unfortunately, hindi pa automated yung mga mga bagay yung sto yung storage system dito. So I, I just can I just cannot be bothered by um uh, dito by making the automated storage system because this is a dangerous place. Underneath here, it's actually a very fiery lava. May mga lava dito underneath and it's very dangerous and I don't wanna parang wala akong patience to do that. And I cannot afford losing lots of XP, lots of items as you can see. Alright, now the nether link. Right now, there are like one, two, three, four, five nether links, if I remember correctly. The first nether link that I made, this is what I'll this is, this is what I was talking about. This is the first nether link uh, that will lead us to the uh, the woodland mansion. We will not cross the woodland mansion, but this was fe I started building this around February of February March of 2021. Tama, 2021, and then yeah, this is the first longest build na nagawa ko. This was around yeah. February, March of 2021. Dito ko nakilala si infamous Benjamin. <laughs> Wala siya right now. We're busy. So, yeah. Ito yung... Ooh. This will lead us to the Woodland Mansion. And... Yeah. Ito yung unang nether link na nagawa ko. Wait. I'm running out of... I'm running out of uh, arrows. I mean, rockets. Wow. Richard. You misspelled rockets very wrong. Hey, I'm sorry. Anyway. So, yeah. Uh, it was difficult to uh, build around here because uh, there's a lava lake above me and everything. This is, the conven this is the convenient way to just get to the woodland mansion. But for desperate reason, like if I want... Uh, Red sandstone. Because there's a nearest uh, badlands over there. So don't go get yung mga red sandstone, red uh, sand, and everything. So yeah, yun yung unang nether link. Now, right beside this nether uh, bunker. Early on, I, I discovered na katabi ko pala yung uh, nether fortress. So I had this weird, wild um, idea na, hey, let's excavate this. So that's what I did. And this was around mid or late 2021, last year. Around this time of the year. Uh, or even earlier than that. So I decided na, hey... Maybe I can excavate the, the nether fortress. And that's what I did. <laughs> it's crazy, but that's what I did. I excavated the nether link. I mean, the nether fortress. Uh, this railroad... Um, uh, the reason why there's a railroad over here is because I transported some piglins that I found. Right? So, uh, anyway, to make long story short, so I decided to excavate it. The buttons right here is to spawn proof. It's because of the gold farm that I showed you earlier. All right. So yeah, I spawn proof everything, place buttons everywhere. Oh, no buttons right here. This is not good. <laughs> anyway, so yeah. So I was saying, I, I, I had this wild idea of excavating the nether link, that nearest nether, nether fortress. Uh, right beside my base. Uh oh. And that's where I get the piglins. <laughs> it brings back a lot of memories. So, yeah. Yeah, this is where I, uh, where I, uh, captured yung mga early piglins. And as you can see, I, I, I just remember this. May mga storage pala ako dito, no? that I completely forgot about. Oops, we need this one. Yeah. Ooh, gold. Right. Oh, wait. I'm gonna place it here. Yeah, so there were, I had a small base right here earlier on because 
I was, you know, I was excavating this. So yeah, this is a big, uh, this is a big uh, nether fortress. It, it turns out, woo, 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 people are angry. Oh, oh, no, no, no. There are piglins. I, I forgot na wala palang nether uniform. <laughs> My nether uniform consists of uh, wearing gold trousers. But I forgot na hindi ko pala suot yun. So anyway. So yeah, I decided to excavate the nether fortress and I, woo, 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 woo. And I discovered that there's a uh, blaze spawner right here. So I decided to make a blaze farm. Uh, it's empty right now, but this is very efficient. Yeah, this is very efficient blaze farm right here. Ooh la la! And then all I need to do is to get my sword and just whack them out. And I'll get a lot of blaze rods. That's how it functions. So yeah. All right. Uh, let's leave this uh, nether fortress. And then let's go somewhere more interesting. Aside from the gold farm right here. <laughs> See how they're interconnected? Uh, this one, by the way. I decided to uh, uh, connect the bridge or whatnot. Because it was a It was a broken bridge. So I decided not to extend it. So that's what I did. First, let me do some admin work. Rami Salamat, guys. This world is three years old. Yeah. So one of the major builds right here. Namok na naman. Nagkatol naman ako ah. Freaking. Anyway. So the nether link, the nether bridge, the nether fortress, the gold farm, and now we will go somewhere where I've been traveling very, very often recently. Okay. Uh, wait. Let me show you. Let me show you the world. Uh, palit muna ako ng uh, Elytra kasi malapit. we've been flying around. <laughs> Alright, let's go. Um, oh! May kalaban! Hey, bonehead! Oh, dalawa sila! Uh-oh. Leave, leave, leave. <laughs> so this one, this nether link right here would lead, would lead me to the end portal. So, nandito yung end portal. Pag lumusot ako dito, nandun yung end portal. Shall we go? Ay, come on. Yeah, it's a sign. Na-disconnect yung keyboard ko, so it's a sign. <laughs> so, yeah, this one is just very near. Even in the overworld. Pero, uh, mas madali and more convenient to travel around by, you know, by uh, Netherlink. So, ito yung end portal. Right? We, we need to put the general now. We need to put the end because there's nothing there that's interesting. But I'm just showing you where where uh, these nether links are interconnected. Yan. Ano ba? So we will from our ow oh, from our nether bunker. We will go. Actually, malapit na tayo matapos sa tour na to eh. So, that's our nether bunker over there. And then, over here is another nether link that will lead us to another far lands. This, oh, oh. Kalaban tayo. Hey! I'm not, I'm not wearing gold trousers and this dude is very angry. You're dead. Hmm. Uh, this one would lead us to a jungle forest. Okay? Hindi tayo lulusot dyan right now. But I'll show you another area, another... What is it again? What is it called here? Bastion something? Anyway, so I, I discovered this area and I decided maybe I can build a honey farm right here. Uh, so I did. I did build... What is it again? Wait, this was around mid this year. What is it again that I did here? Ayun, honey, honey bottle, honey thingy, honeys, honey farm. So that's what I built right here. The reason why I built it right here is because uh, the bees will work over time, uh, walang day and night cycle. So uh, yeah, they're gonna build, they're gonna work over time. I just, I just, uh oh, wait, 
okay, may bote pa pala. Kasi I just realized na hindi ko pala na-refill tong bottles na to. And I also decided to build Honeycomb Farm. Yeah. But I'm not, this is not, uh oh. This is not very uh, efficient because it has a lot of problem. Piglins spawn down there. Ayun no, kita nyo ba? The piglins spawn over there. And then sometimes hoglins spawn inside. So, diba, there are times na piglins are parang galit sa hoglins and they shoot at it. And once they miss the hoglins, pag natamaan yung bees, the bees will attack the piglin. So, namamatay yung mamata yung bees and that's not nice you get my point but in theory they're very they're supposed to be efficient uh, as you can see daming honeycomb uh oh wow ang dami na pala well ang dami na palang uh, produce but it's not as efficient as I hope it would be it's not as efficient guys so yeah Anyway, uh, did I say an observer? Hmm, I would need an observer. I'll show you why. Oh, I will also need the redstone. <laughs> and we need something. Let me salvage, uh, salvage something first uh, before I uh, before we move on to the other part of the tour. Oh. You also need that. Anyway, so yeah, this is the honey farm. I plan to build some... I, I, yeah, it's not as efficient as I thought it would be. Especially itong honeycomb farm. So I... In, in sometime, sometime later or whenever I feel like it, whenever I feel like there's a need to uh, build the honey farm, I'm gonna build it sa end. Ayun, sa end ko i-build. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Bigalit, bigalit sa akin. Okay. Ah uh, ha. Okay, what do we? Um, right now we will. We're towards the end of the tour. Uh, as you can see in this in this area of the Nether Lake, I uh, I am using <laughs> I am using atong uh, iron blocks as a design para to flex na I am that rich. <laughs> but right now I am not that rich unfortunately because I ran out of iron because I needed uh, lots of hoppers and up hoppers need a lot of iron so uh, there's a, a little bit a hint of regret with my decision making uh, to build this out of iron it could have been something. It could have been, you know, the usual. It could have been the usual, you know, smooth stone. I don't know what went in my mind to build this out of iron blocks. Probably to flex. And now I'm kind of running short on iron a supply of iron. Okay. Now, now we will go to the final part of the tour. Uh. Two parts. First, this this is the longest build na nagawa ko. Alright? Wala pa yung nether link na pinakita ko sa inyo earlier. This is the longest build na nagawa ko. It's 4,000 blocks. Uh, uh oh, they're very angry. Ow! Very angry piglins kasi wala akong uniform. Uh, if I travel through overworld, this will take me... 20,000 blocks to travel on the overworld from the base, from the ground zero where I spawn to this new base. The reason why I started a new base in this area is because it's 1.19 and 1.19 came out. So I decided that maybe it's time to move on. So that's that's the reason why we're traveling here. <laughs> if I travel through here, uh yung 20,000 blocks into like 83%. So, mas shorter yung uh, travel time. Uh, the only thing na hindi ko pa natapos dito is itong area na to. Kasi I ran out of ice and wala pa akong functioning ice farm. 
because you know with the one point with the 1.19 uh, update uh, in the build height and the freezing point or freezing area of water has changed so wala pa akong iron wala pa akong ice farm for that hello dave we're at the last part of the tour oh my goodness muntik ko mahulog yeah and now i present to you the biggest build uh oh it's building the biggest build that i've done in this series are you ready are you ready it's not this house. It's not this house. This is a starter house in this area. Uh, nakita niya yata sa background. It's right here. Are you ready? Are you ready? Hindi pa, hindi pa nalo-load. This is the biggest build na nagawa ko. Yeah. For those who just joined in, uh, we're at the final part of the world tour. This is the biggest build na nagawa ko and the most optimistic. <laughs> See, wow, sakit sa mata, snow. Damn it. Anyway, so yeah, this is the biggest build. This is 128 by 128. Uh, in total, okay? So yeah, it's the biggest build na nagawa ko in this world and it's not yet finished. This is the new base. It's called the Pyramid obviously but i want an official name for this hmm yeah so this is where i've been spending most of my time lately just working on starting new base well starting new life quote and quote um with lots of uh materials it's like starting a new world but with you know stuff prepared uh, beforehand so it's less challenging the only challenge uh, I can see over here is to you know because it's really really massive and very you know I want all the farms to be inside all the storage farms uh, to be inside this dome to this under this pyramid as you can see my nandito na yung biggest storage na gawa ko, which is partially working as you can see and then right now, uh, my XP farm is already working. Well, it's working very well, to be honest. Too well to the point that, you know, my fuel is. <laughs> I have a lot of fuel. Because I. The uh, design of uh, bamboo farm is so efficient. Uh, I'm having. Well, I'm having a too much supply of bamboo. Ah, yeah. Speaking of too much supply of bamboo, uh, nakita nyo na yun, kaya pala naglalag dito sa area na to eh. It's really overflowing. I'm gonna address that right now. Teka lang. I have to address that right now. I'm gonna interrupt this world tour by sorting off some smooth stone. <laughs> My gosh, this is embarrassing. Ah. So yeah. So what's the f what's the future for for the series? Well, I'm gonna continue on building. The uh, I made the rule that the series will end once the world corrupts or get cor gets corrupted. That's the rule. Okay. Uh, yeah. Why not? And then it's gonna it's gonna stay it's gonna stay uh, single player because uh, that will this. Well, if I if I if I let anyone in, that will destroy the principle and the basis of why I call why I started this series. Teka nga. Oh man. Teka lang, ah. I need, this is kind of embarrassing. I'll edit this out. You're not you're not you're not seeing this. Wow. <laughs> you see nothing. This is edited out. You don't see this. Oh man, this is so. Ah, okay. We have to get rid of some bamboos. We have oversupply of bamboo. Wow, stack after stack, after stack, after stack. <laughs> yeah, embarrassing. But hey, that's what happens. All right, uh, how do we? How are we gonna end this tour? 
I just, this is the last part of the tour. Itong biggest build nagawa ko eh. So, uh, let's pretend na uh, this is not happening. <laughs> yeah, so I think we can conclude the uh, tour already here. Kasi, yeah, I showed you everything. Uh, we are 20,000 blocks away from our, you know, from our OG base. And I'm gonna continue building this off camera. And yeah, that's the end of the tour. Maraming salamat, guys. And thanks for the support. Uh, for those who've been supporting for the past two, three years, 20 years to listen to being uh, three years. Maraming salamat. I mean, it's, it's kind of weird, no? Knowing that I'm doing this. Tapos may mga people saying na, oh, wow, Richard, you're playing video games and you're live streaming. Yeah. So, and pe people, sometimes people make, uh, you know, put too much color into it. But that's okay. I wish those colors were real, though. <laughs> Pero I really appreciate it. I really appreciate it. Appreciate. Appreciate it big time, boom time. Uh, yeah, I, I pretend that hindi to nangyayari. Yeah. <laughs> What's that? Um, yeah. Thank you very much. I have some major sorting sorting up. Uh, kailangan ko asikasuhin. There's an Enderman. Wow. There's an Ender Dandy man. Teka nga. I need to sort things out. Teka lang. Uh, the redstone box. I need to sort things out. I need to get my... Uh, Emergency storage. Uh, nasan siya ang aking... Ayun. Chest. This is just emergency. Ayan. For those just joined in, marami salamat. Unfortunately, we're at the end of the tour. Uh, we're gonna end this live stream in like five minutes already. Marami salamat, guys. We will still continue. The world, uh, uh, the, the Lonely World series will continue uh, as long as the world or the file is intact. And if, uh, if you're like me, always back up your... Open. Always back up your file to avoid disappointments. <laughs> Para hindi makorap. You know, I take this like uh, parang I take this like my art stuff. So uh, it's an artwork. Anything, anything that stimulates your mind to force yourself to create. Para sa akin, it's art. So um, there's even a debate na. No, is Minecraft Minecraft uh, art or you know there were debate may mga debates or discussions asking if uh, Minecraft creations are for are a form of uh, creativity and I guess it's true if you're if oh what's this if you're an art person maybe you would understand so let me know what you think. Uh, I might, I might be, I might be making a YouTube video out of this. Pero let's see. I just can't be bothered making Minecraft videos eh, right now, because I'm handling other things, my real life stuff, and all that. But anyway, while I'm cleaning this up, thank you very much for those who supported, who supported for the past three years. Uh, take care of one another, love one another, and you know. I'll see you Friday. Wala akong live stream ng Wednesday because uh, real life stuff. Um, yeah. Let me know what you think and I'll see you on Friday. Alright? Friday. Yeah, Friday. Thank you very much. I apologize for this. I apologize for this uh, city thing na nangyari. Overflowing supply of fuel. But that's okay. Alright, anyway. Thank you very much. Take care of one another. Love one another. Hindi ako makalipad. And I'll see you Friday, okay? Bye-bye. 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 I hope you enjoyed the tour or else I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna be very, very sad. Hee hee hee. Anyway, bye-bye. Hi, Felix. Pipahabol. <laughs> You're late, man. You're late. Active ka pa rin sa same world? Yes, this is the same world. I just gave you a tour. So, in three minutes, pag natapos tong livestream nato, you can replay to see 
what I've been through. <laughs> You're late, but na- bakit ngayon ka lang dumating sa live stream ko? <laughs> This is the same world, man. With new base. I hope you enjoy. You can watch the replay. May mga highlights naman eh. Bye! We're, we're at the end of the... Well, literally at the end kasi matatapos na itong livestream na ito. Alright? Bye!